Hey everyone, Stephanie here, coffee drinker, book lover, and reviewer of many things, and today I'm losing my mind. Um, I have already started this video twice. I forgot the first time um, we had to stop because my kid needed me. The second time I got four minutes in and um, realized that my headphones were still attached. This has happened to another video that I made earlier. Um, we'll talk about that in that video. Okay, we're focusing on this. This video is going to be about Amazon Halloween stuff. Apparently, Amazon has a big um, deal going on if you have Prime or if you sign up for Prime um, on the 8th and the 9th is what I'm understanding, and I got an email about it because I'm a uh, Amazon associate, and so um, I'm going to go through their, Halloween's, their Halloween section and point out some stuff that I would like for myself and some things that I'm like, is that Halloween? <laughs> um, so that is what we're doing today, and... Hopefully this is a good video because I am not making this video again. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's start. Let me click the Halloween button. I already had Amazon pulled up. It says, okay, it says big, no, it says prime big deal days, October 8th and 9th. And then um, this is for... The people with Prime membership, and it also says that you can join and then go and like you'll be accepted into this. What's it called? You'll be able to do this deal, the limited time deal. Okay. So, first off, the first thing I see are these eyeball light bulbs. Oh my goodness. It shows, like, the whole yard covered, but I don't think that you'd be getting that many. I think you'd be getting enough for, like, two or three bushes. Um, I would totally, totally use these. I love things like this, like the creepy, like, oh. Um, let's see what else we got. Uh, these, these pants. Those are not Halloween. Moving on. Um, oh! Floating candles. This are not, these are not in the order that they were when I first reviewed, I uh, started this, my headphones were still in. So, uh, check out these. I didn't see these before. Um, I would use these. It says that they're for Christmas or weddings, but I would totally use like Harry Potter themed. Harry Potter themed. Um, 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 oh, what is this? Is this a Halloween shirt? I love Halloween shirts. Oh, but it's the, the three fourth links. Mm. Well, I, I could probably just push the sleeves up, but I would totally wear this. It's got the the pumpkins, and it's got ghosts, and skeletons, and the moon. I can't tell if that's a witch or a tree branches, um, but yes. This shirt. Oh, there's more. I'm sorry, I'm going through all of the... The options now, they also have this one. Oh, I love this one. Orange with the, the bats and the spider webs. Let's see, what else do they have? Oh, this one. This is the one I want. This one right here. The kitty cats and the pumpkins. Okay, okay, okay. What else? Anything else? Oh, yes. The witches, the bats, black pumpkins. Mm, that's going to be a hard choice. I might have to get the kitty cat one and the purple one with the witches. Oh, man. They make things like this so hard because there's so many options. Okay, okay. Moving on. Sorry, I got distracted. 
Um, let's see. Oh, this is the cutest, the leaf thief. It says it is a perfect fall book for children. I know it's not Halloween. But look at it, it's so cute. It says, Squirrel loves to count leaves on his tree. Red leaves, gold leaves, orange leaves, and more. But hold on, one of his leaves is missing. On a quest to find the missing leaf, Squirrel teams up with his good friend Bird to discover who the leaf thief could be among the forest friends. <gasps> Oh, I want, I want it. It's so cute. Um, I, I love fall books and Halloween books and, you know, books. Just, just books. I could just talk about books forever. Okay. Um, black balloons, you know. Halloween lights, you know, the purple and orange ones. I'm not going to put a picture of those because I feel like you can just look for that. Um, okay, this is cute. Um, this It's called an elegant bell sleeve cocktail dress. It's orange. It's kind of modest. Um, it says that you could wear it as a wedding vest or to a church mid mid-evening dress <laughs> um okay like i might wear something like this it's a it's neutral maybe the thanksgiving um let's see what else they have oh these candles these candles yes okay um let's see do they come they do. I love these. These would sit on my bookshelf. What do you think? Yeah. yeah. I have a question. Okay, what's your question? Knock, knock. That's not a question. Knock, knock. Who's there? Banana. Oh, banana who? So these little candles are battery operated. How cool is that? <gasps> Glow sticks. Okay, so if you've watched some of my previous videos, I've talked about glow sticks and how we we do. We use glow sticks in the bathtub sometimes. And, you know, we just love glow sticks. Glow sticks are really good when you go trick-or-treating. You can attach it to part of your kid's outfit or get the necklace and the bracelets, um, put the bracelets around their ankles. And I remember one year I tied, she, uh, my kiddo had um, her, the back of her costume um, had like a crisscrossy overalls type thing. And I stuck a glow stick to the, uh, like I tied a glow stick there so she couldn't get it off and there was not a chance that it was going to fall off. Glow sticks are great to make sure that you can still see your kid um, because nothing is scarier than it getting dark and you're like, well, where's my toddler? Uh, ow, sorry. Uh, terrifying, right? Oh no, things changed. Um, <gasps> Food to die for. That looks like something I need, even if I don't eat the food out of it. It says, Recipes and stories from Americans' most legendary haunted places. <gasps> what? Discover tantalizing recipes, spine tingling stories, and historical photos from the most notoriously haunted locations across America in this fun, fantastical, oh, I'm sorry, okay. fascinating cookbook. Paranormal investigator and kindred spirits co-host Amy Burney leads 
you through eerie hotels, haunted homes, hellish hospitals, and spooky ghost towns, giving you stories and recipes from each place. <gasps> what? Oh my goodness. Whether you're in the mood for Lizzie Borden's meatloaf or want to serve up spooky prison stories along with sugar cookies from Alcatraz, Food to Die For is your guide to ghoulish gastronomy. Gastron I can't even say it. Gastronomy. Gastronomy. Gastronomy? Anyway, I want this book. This is going on my wish list. Wish list, the one that I do whenever I give out to my family. Whenever they're like, hey, what do you want for Christmas? Um, <sighs> I want this book so bad. Um, look, I'm like so excited. Um, okay, okay, okay. Next, next. I'm only going to do a few of these, so... Okay. Mm, let's see what else catches my attention. I mean, like, there's a lot of stuff on this list, but it's just, like, mm, some sweaters, some shirts, some, like, tablecloths. Oh, that's cute. My cat went... <laughs> there's bat wings for cats. Uh, my cat does not like costumes, so I just move right past that. Um, it has a lot of pretty cool stuff in here. Oh, snap. Oh, you remember earlier when I talked about floating candles? This one you turn on with a wand. That's, that's cool. Okay. Um, I think this one wins over the last floating candle. Just because how cool would it be to have guests over and then push the button on your wand and... Killer's purring. Does that mean he loves you? Um, I just... Anything Harry Potter. Anything Harry Potter. Whoa. Please don't do that. Yes. Anything Harry Potter. You know. You know. I am a Harry Potter person. Um, things just spazzed out. Let me see if I can get it back to where I was. Here. I was here. There are several things that I'm seeing right now that I personally want. Um... Okay, I'll just go through them real fast. This dress. This dress looks very Halloween. It's kind of renaissance -y, And um, I think I would want it in black. Oh, there's a red also. Oh, black or red. I'm not sure, but they're both very pretty. And then... It's just a bunch of hocus pocus. It's just a bunch of hocus pocus. Duh. Yes. And I love that it has like the. Okay. I love that it has like the orange and the black with the bats. This, this shirt. Yes. Or a sweatshirt. Sorry. I would totally wear this. I'm not even going to go through the other options because I see that they have t-shirts and other sweatshirts too. And I'm going to want them all. So I'm just going to click out, click back out to the next thing. Um, stickers. A bunch of stickers. I love Halloween stickers. I love um, doing Halloween baggies or like goodie bags for like the first 20 people that show up to the front door. Um, I try to do more than 20, but you know, it depends on how much I can spend. Um, but stickers are always great. And then I can also use them with my kid. We do a matching sticker game like, oh, where's the pumpkin with this face? Um, and stuff like that, like stickers.
Snickers. My foot's asleep and it's really bothering me. Um, the science spell book. Science spell book. Oh my goodness. That is cool. Um, brew a stunning color changing tea. Learn about chaos theory while creating art with a pendulum. Create a metal, I'm sorry, create a meal that glows under a black light. Make a homemade compass and more. Uh, yes. Yes, please. I want this too. Okay. Yeah. Anyone else like doing science experiments? Does anyone else like doing science experiments with their kids? Because it's just like, oh, look at this. Look at this. Um, I get so excited. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm weird. Okay. I found something else that is not fall. <laughs> what is this? These are just towels. You can just get black and white towels for everyday life. Um, towels are not Halloween. I don't know why they're on the Halloween list. It's weird to me. I'm not going to go very much longer on this list. Um, there are some other cool things. Ooh, what's that? <gasps> That's going to be a scarecrow for Halloween. I'm going to be a scarecrow for Halloween? Okay. Um... This is cool. It's like the scratch paper and they're in different shapes and then the kids get to scratch um, and it's like rainbow color underneath. And these are cool. Uh, I love these. My kid has some difficulty with them still. She's only four um, so she doesn't push down very hard when doing them. But yeah, I would still get these because they'd be fun to do for me and then she would be able to scratch as she could. Um, um, there's some other books on here. I'm not going to go through them all. We know Halloween books are Halloween books. You could just type in Halloween books and I'm sure they'd pop up. Uh, there's some Goose Goosebumps game. What? I just said I wasn't going to click on things that were book related. But it's a monster board game. Okay. It's a monster board game from the Goosebumps. Oh my goodness. This is so cool. Uh I don't even I don't even care what the instructions are. I just think it's cool. Okay. I need to stop. I've already made a pretty long list. Um, if I keep going, this video is going to be extremely long. What am I at? About 23 minutes. Um, hopefully this video will be shorter than that. I will... Ow, my leg is asleep and my hip just popped. <sighs> okay. I will leave a link for everything I talked about in the description. Um, if you click on the link, it'll take you straight to the item. And if you decide to buy using the link, I get a few pennies of the sales price. And I say it that way because um, in the past, I think I've sold like a hundred and something dollars and I've only made like three or four dollars off of all of that. So keep that in mind. It's not like I'm getting rich off of if you use my link or not. Um, I don't think it even affects the price of what you're buying. So you would, even if you didn't use my link, you would still be paying $15 and some change or whatever. Um, <laughs> just keep that in mind. I appreciate it if you use my link. Oh, my foot is so asleep. Oh my goodness. Um, this is what I get for Sneakers Cross. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I know I ramble a lot and um, I try not to. Okay. Um, give me a thumbs up if you liked this video. If you like getting more information like this from about the Amazon deals that are going on, let me know and I will start making more videos like this. Um, I only did it because I got an email and was like, hey, you should do this. And I was like, you know what? 
I should because I'm already going to be looking at all of this stuff. Um, comment below if I talked about anything that you like. Um, I don't know. You just comment below and be like, hey, what's up? Uh, that'd be cool too. And um, subscribe if you want to subscribe. If you're not sure if you want to subscribe, click my face. It'll be down here somewhere. Um, I'm not ever sure which side I'm on whenever I select where my face is going to be in the little bubbly thing. Um, but you can click on it and go check out the rest of my book. You can click on it and check out the rest of my um, videos. I do book videos for kids and adults, and I do review videos. I try things out, um, talk about coffee randomly. I talk about nail polish. I, I took my nail polish off, guys. Um, I'm going to paint ghosts on them. I um, haven't done it yet. I'm going to be taking a shower and didn't want to. Anyway, anyway, you don't need to know about that. Um, yeah, I talk about random stuff because I want to, not because of anything else, really. I just, it, that's why um, my videos are so sporadic. Um, and share this video because someone else might want to know about the um, Amazon Prime big day that's coming up. I don't know. Um, remember that it is the 8th and the 9th that this is happening. So um, the deals that you see, if you click today and the deals aren't there, uh, check the 8th and the 9th of 2024 in case you're watching this in the future. And um, that's it. I'll see you on my next video.